Hello guys and welcome back to another Fallout 4 mod spotlight video. This time around we're going to be checking out the unofficial Fallout 4 patch. Which is a bit of a, a, a misleading thing because uh, I can't actually check it out. It's kind of just a thing you have to install. Uh, so I can't really show it off. But I can tell you a little bit about it and that's going to be that. It's going to be a super short video. But just to remind you guys you always should install the unofficial Fallout 4 patch. It fixes so many bugs and issues in the game. Um, now the issues are probably not that often you, you finally actually encounter those issues. Um, it could be quests not activating, uh, objects looking off, clipping in the environment. Um, just, just things that you might notice and things that could be game breaking. There are some game breaking things like some quests not activating, uh, so on and so forth. So this is simply a must have for every single mod load order. Even if you don't really plan on modding the game, the unofficial Fallout 4 patch is a must have for everyone um because for the most part it's like any other game it patches the things in the game after release but that's typically abandons their games fairly fast maybe in one or two or three years so having the actual awesome mothers uh, actually go ahead and fix this is awesome um the author is artmore and uh, i will have a link to the actual mod in the description below so uh, I hope you guys will install it because they deserve the, the, the little install. And, and don't forget to endorse it too if, if you really think it's useful. Uh, but that's pretty much all I had to say for it. Uh, if there's one mod I recommend you install for any playthrough of Fallout 4, it is definitely the unofficial Fallout 4 patch. Everything else is more taste, but this is pretty much a must-have for every single load order. And I'm not even joking. It, it, it is something you must have. Otherwise, you might encounter... Otherwise, your experience with the game might be bad. So, um, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, if you did, consider liking, subscribing, and sharing. Hope to see you in the next uh, Fallout 4 Mud Spotlight video. Again, these are not supposed to be long. They're supposed to be short and to the point. Uh, and just to, for me to kind of review a, a mud slash give my opinion on a mud and kind of have you guys try to... You can see I have another mud enabled. You don't ignore that. <laughs> Anyway, I hope that you guys have another one of my spotlight videos, and as always, stay awesome.